I'm Paul Coxon from the Department of Material Science and Metallurgy. I research anti-reflection coatings to improve the efficiency of solar cells. The book which I've chosen is no great work of literature. It's a children's book and it tells the story of a little boy who invents a submarine to go and search for the Loch Ness Monster. He tests his submarine. It works. They do have a, f a slight mishap halfway through the journey when they get stuck in some weeds. Hence the book's title, SOS Bobo Mobile. One of the, the tools which he invented was an auto pen to get him out of homework. It's called a teacher answering scripto machine. So it's a typewriter connected to an arm with a pen. So he uses this device to copy out his parents' handwriting to excuse him from all the homework which is distracting him from his very important research project in tracking down the Loch Ness Monster. It inspired me uh, to sort of develop my own methods and techniques, um, building new apparatus to uh, further my own research, testing and characterisation of our new materials. So it's something which I've, I've tried to stick with all my life. If you can build it yourself cheaply, cost effectively, it can often do just as good work as a, a commercially bought, bought piece of apparatus. Uh, on my conservatory roof I've got some water collectors and they turn the little turbines that powers the, the, the patio lights. Uh, it sort of it goes in the flow of the water off the gutter, little turbine turns a little dynamo and you get patio lights. So it means that you have lit up patio when it rains. Well in my own research today I have a home built holder to hold my wafers which I process and blacken. No one's done this before so I've had to work on my own working out how to hold these wafers in a particular way and so I have a, a rather inelegant but efficient way of holding a stack of wafers so that I can immerse them in our molten salts and texturize them. You get a real sense of achievement with it. You feel like a little bit of an explorer doing something for the first time. And if it works, that's a great, great, great feeling of success.